So this is update number 11. We are back in Bone after a very full day of tasting. We started in the Cote de Bone, and then jogged up to the Cote de Nuit, and then back to the Cote de Bone, and uh, now we are back in the city of Bone. And at the end of the day, we're tasting a series of beautiful Rieslings that our uh, German producer has sent us all the way from the Mosul. So we started the morning with a drive down to Chassagne Moranche, uh, which is in the Cote de Bone. It's one of the great white wine towns of the world. The wines here are made of pure Chardonnay, with uh, beautiful lemon acidity and nice exotic notes of coconut and mango. And the wines here are really going to be wonderful in 2014. They're going to be an excellent vintage and one that's going to age particularly well, we think, too. We drove about five minutes further south to Saint-Denis, uh, which is the neighboring town where we work with a producer who makes whites and reds. And the 2014s were excellent across the board, so those are going to be really drinkable, very young. We had a little lunch and then drove up to Nuit Saint-Georges in the Côte de Nuit, uh, and the producer here showed us some 2015s from the barrel, which are just exceptional. There's a lot of density, really ripe fruit, something uh, something really to, to consider aging for a bit too. Finally, we drove back down to the Côte de Bone to O.C. Duress, which is where we work with the producer and tasted yet more 2014 whites and reds, which were across the board excellent, full of lively fruit and really easily accessible tannins. They're going to drink really well young. So we'll finish up the Rieslings, and before long we'll be going out to dinner with some vignerons who have become friends. It's one of the great pleasures of this business. And tomorrow we are tasting with some friends from Boston, actually, who are in town, and we will be up in Von Romanet and tasting at a place uh, just around the corner from here. So that's it for tasting update number 11, and we'll see you back here tomorrow.